senators, Manchin and Cinema are aligning with the Republicans on debt! Exclamation point. Senator Mike Braun joins us now. Mr. Senator, this sounds like a breakthrough to me, is it? Well, they need a, a few more than just Cinema and Manchin, but I'm glad those two have been kind of the stalwarts that have prevented even more craziness from this federal government. But uh, yeah, it looks like they're coalescing on the uh, common sense approach. I mean, it's not that hard to do. We haven't done a budget in nearly 20 years. Uh, we're now 31 trillion in debt. The interest that we're going to be paying is going to crowd out so much other stuff. So I don't know how the rest of Democrats get by with saying that we need more of this insanity. In fact, right after this, I'm going to wrestle in a budget hearing. And in the little over four years I've been here, Stu, we've not done one budget resolution or budget period in the mechanics of it. You talk about one issue after another. That's why we're in this mess. Thank goodness they're holding firm among, I guess, the other 49 Democrats. <laughs> <laughs> you try to count them. I got you. Okay. Now, whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait a minute. I've only just seen this. Biden is working with environmentalists to limit hunting and fishing in multiple states. I think you're on the Agriculture Committee, and I think you're on the Forestry Committee. What's this all about? I'm on both, and I hunt and fish all the time. <laughs> it's good therapy for my new job. So this is how crazy this administration, and, of course, it isn't going to be through a law. They're going to do that through an executive order or a ruling. So if you can't do it the old-fashioned way, just try to ram it through. So I hope that's another crazy idea that gets put onto the ash heap. But they are enterprisers. If they can't get it done, you know, legislatively, they'll that's try it. that. That's it. Yeah, it's, which it's is the, sad. It's the administrative state. You can't it, it, get it a law is. passed because you haven't got the politics right. So you get your bureaucracy to issue an order. That doesn't work sad. for me. No, and that's, that's a, that is an end around of democracy, which they always talk about. Uh, if you can't do it the old-fashioned way, don't do it at all. Don't force it through the administrative branch. So you've got to leave us and go straight into the building behind you and wrestle for hours on end about some mundane details of the budget. Is that what you've got to do today? That's what I'm doing next. And the first thing I'm going to ask is, will you agree to actually doing a budget next year. Fiscal year starts on October 1st. We haven't even gotten close <laughs> to doing any of the regular order, do these continuing resolutions, kick it down the road. Thank goodness Kevin McCarthy in the House said enough is enough. Unless you want our kids and grandkids to have this heavy load on them, it's a terrible business plan for the future of our country. Terrible. Yes, sir. Mr. Senator, always a pleasure. Thanks very much for being with us today. Yes, sir. My pleasure, too. You got it.